Second example that uh, we're going to look at is the number of touchdowns thrown by 32 quarterbacks during the 2008 NFL season. So this is actual data that you can find online. So looking at this, our data ranges from the single digits to the 30s. So what we have here is 0, 1, 2, and 3. Okay, so our single digit, we have two eights, so I put an eight and an eight, so let me cross those off, and a nine. Okay, so next up, what we're looking at are the ones that start with a ones digit in that uh, tens place, so everything that goes from 10 to 19. So it looks like we have an 11, we have another 11, Going across here, we have one more 11. Uh, let's look for the 12s. We have a 12 here. We have a 12 in that third row. And we have a 12 in the fourth row. Uh, any 13s, we have a 13 in that second row. We have a 13 in the third row. And we have a 13 in that fourth row. Uh, any 14s as we go across, we see there's one 14, so I put a 4 here. 15s, we have a 15 in that first row. We have two of them in the third row. Okay, any 16s, we see we have one 16 here. 17s, we have a 17 in the third row, so I put a 17 here. 18s, we have two 18s in that last row. And then finally, we have a 19. Okay, so now in the 20s, we don't have anything that's 20, but we have two 21s. We have a 22, we have a 23, we have a 25, we have a 26, a 27, and a 28. Okay, and then finally we're left to the ones in the 30s. We have one that's exactly 30. And then we have 34 and 34. So that's our distribution. Now, with a stem plot like this, it might be a little more difficult to actually get the shape here. Uh, I don't know. Would you argue it's symmetric? Would you argue it's right skewed? So maybe it's right skewed, depending how we broke it up. Uh, it doesn't really look like there's any real outliers. It looks like possibly our cluster of our data. We have a one that's in the 11 to 19 range. You know, a lot of observations in here. Uh, how would you quantify that spread? What, how spread out it is? Well, it seems like we have the bulk of our data in that 11 to 28 range. Um, Center might be somewhere in that 11 to 19 range as well. So again, this is sort of the type of game that we're playing when we have a graph such as this.